This video walks you through downloading, modifying, and uploading state and local government prices for VAST Online. By uploading these files to your VAST Online system, products can be sold at the terms negotiated between state and business entities and Goodyear Corporate. These agreed upon prices mean that these products are often sold at a loss. So, by uploading these pricing files, you can ensure that these sales result in a credit by Goodyear. To start, let's download these pricing files from Goodyear's Tire HQ. In your web browser, go to www.tire-hq.com. Type your username and password to log into your Tire HQ account. Hover over your Dealer Programs tab, then click Approvals Info Pricing under the Government Sales heading. In the column on the left-hand side, click State and Local. A list of states will appear. Click your state's link. Along the bottom, click the Excel sheet format to download it onto your computer. You will see the Excel sheet downloading to your computer. Once the file has downloaded, double-click the file to open it. Now that we have the pricing file, let's walk through how to modify it so that you can successfully upload it to VAST Online. If prompted to leave Protected View, click Yes. And if prompted to enable editing, enable editing. Now, you'll need to rename some of the column headings. Change the product code heading to part code, all one word. Brand, or MFG, should be changed to MFG code. The column that contains retail pricing should be changed just to say price. Take note of the pricing's applicable date in the heading. We'll need this information when we import the file later. You will also need to remove the dollar sign from the price column. Highlight the price column. In the Excel toolbar, click Format, then click Format Cells. Click Number, and make the format two decimal places. Now. Remove all other columns and delete all other header rows and images. The MFG codes will need to be changed to VAST Online compatible names. VAST Online's manufacturer codes are limited to seven characters. And though these codes are not case sensitive, we'll stick with uppercase. Use Control F to find and replace the following MFG codes. Change Goodyear to GoodYR. Change American to AMERI. Save the file as a CSV or comma delimited file. Agree to any prompts about saving multiple sheets or potentially losing features. Now that we've downloaded and modified the pricing file, it's time to import the file into VAST Online. In VAST Online, click the maintenance icon from the vertical toolbar. Now, we're going to look up the price level assigned to your local government customers. Under the Customer heading, click Customer Types. Click the pencil icon next to Local Government. In the default price level field, you'll see the price level assigned to these local government customer types. Now that you know your target price level, click the Maintenance icon again from the vertical toolbar. Under the Price heading, click Price Levels. Click the pencil icon next to the price level that you found was the default price level field in the local government customer type. In the Pricing Level Detail window, change the Date From and Date To fields to encompass the date range when the pricing file will apply to your locations. This date can be found in the heading of the original file. Select the locations that the pricing file will apply to. Click Import. Choose the modified pricing file from your computer. Click Upload File. You'll see a list of the information being imported. If a product is unchecked in the Is Valid column, it usually means that the product number is currently not in your VAST Online database. You can use the Selection dropdown to display only valid or invalid imports. Let's look for the invalid items by choosing Invalid Only and clicking the Multiple Search icon. If you see a large number of invalid items, you may want to use the tire downloader to retrieve information for any product or product lines you feel should be in your database. 
Click Update to import your pricing file. Click Yes to confirm that you'd like to import the pricing file. Click Save. You've now successfully downloaded, modified, and uploaded a state and local government pricing file. Thank you for watching.